All right, what's up everybody? So what a beautiful day for AMC. I want to talk about two things. Going into the green tomorrow, how, how high are we going to go? And then the stock market crash that everybody's talking about. The China nonsense over the fear is gone. Today you saw the market correction and AMC benefited from it. So tomorrow, because we saw, you know, we're in control. Okay, the dust is settled. The manipulation is over. You got to see actual retail investors controlling the price of AMC. And when we do, what happens? We slowly chip this bad boy up, right? We were grinding up today and it's going to continue into tomorrow into what I believe is going to be a $43 hit. So you're also going to see some selling off tomorrow if we do hit that $43 because everybody's in this for a different reason and people are going to be grinding, waiting for that $43 so that they can take profit. Um, don't be surprised if you see it sell down. So if she taps that 43, of course, she's going to sell down a little bit. As far as the stock market crashing, listen, we're living in a new age. It's the age of the investor. You know how they say, well, we're on this bull run and it only lasts about four years and we're extended on the four years, this bull run, this bull run. Well, listen, guys, it's because everybody is an investor nowadays. The janitor at your high school, he's an investor. The girl handing you the food at McDonald's drive through she's an investor. Everybody invests, and it's because of Robinhood. It's because of how easy technology has made it. You don't need a broker. You and I, we're the broker now. You're on Robinhood or Weeble or Fidelity, whatever it is, man. You get to do, you get to make your own plays. You could be sitting on a freaking toilet trading AMC in the morning. That's how easy it is. Therefore, it's out with the old, in with the new trends. And if this thing, if we continue on a bull run, we could be on a bull run for eight years because we have to get used to what technology has handed us. We haven't done that yet. Once again, we are living in the age of the retail investor, the home investor. All right. I don't care where I am. I can be in a restaurant. People are talking about AMC, Dogecoin. I could be at my own restaurant. People are coming in recognizing me from YouTube and they want to talk about AMC and Dogecoin. It's just amazing. People you would never even guess know about this shit. They might know more than some of us and they have their ways. It's crazy because I'll talk to people about AMC when they come in my restaurant and they all have their price targets. Everybody's like, yeah, well, I'm, I'm selling at $700. I expect it to go to $1,200. Yeah, we're going to get $2,000 out of AMC. It's crazy how passionate people are and you don't even realize it. Your school teacher is probably invested in AMC. Not just your banker, babysitter is invested in AMC. You see how, how wide this has gone. Therefore, it's going to take a lot more and a lot longer for the stock market to crash because there's more of us. Retail investors are controlling this and ruling this right now like something we've never freaking seen before. So that's my take on why... I'm not worried about a market crash. All right. So AMC, let's see that $43 tomorrow. And uh, I'm hoping for two awesome days in a row, not just tomorrow, but the day after. So we'll see what happens. Y'all have an awesome night. Doge Warrior out. Shaboom. Peace.